Hi, I'm Jigger Shaw, Director of the Department of Energy's Loan Programs Office, and I'm so excited to announce our latest conditional commitment for a loan of up to $700 million to Ioneer Rhyolite Ridge in Nevada to advance the domestic production of lithium and boron to help boost America's battery supply chain. Here are five big things you need to know about this project. One, this conditional commitment follows two other critical minerals loans closed by LPO in the past year, all focused on supporting domestic EV battery manufacturing. Two, if issued, this loan will finance the construction of a new lithium carbonate processing facility at Rhyolite Ridge, providing the nation with a critical mineral used in the production of EV batteries. Three, at full production capacity, Rhyolite Ridge is expected to annually produce enough lithium carbonate for approximately 370,000 electric vehicles. It is also projected to displace 145 million gallons of gasoline annually, preventing the release of 1.3 million tons of carbon dioxide each year. Four, the project is expected to benefit Nevada's economy by creating up to 600 construction jobs and between 250 and 300 good paying operations jobs. Five, as with all conditional commitments that DOE offers, it is important to note that no funds have been dispersed for Rhyolite Ridge yet, and the loan will only be issued pending the satisfaction of certain conditions, including final legal, contractual, technical, and financial requirements that the conditional commitment specifies. I am so excited to announce DOE's support of this project because strengthening America's critical material supply chains, growing U.S. critical materials workforce, and having a reliable domestic supply of critical materials like lithium carbonate is crucial to our national security, foreign policy, and economy. 